boys. What is up? It is your boy D, and this is D's Cards. I know it's been a little while, but today I got a pack battle with one of the best father-son duos out there. I'm pack battling against Heart of the Pack. We are going to be going in on a booster box of Blazing Vortex, which just came out. Now, I love this guy's content. I'm super excited to be collabing with him. It's a father-son story that Yugi Moto would be quite jealous of. As we know, his main father figure is a guy from ancient Egypt that kind of competed him for going into the Shadow Realm at some point. So, honestly, it's really heartwarming content. I really recommend you guys check them out. I'll have a link to their channel in the description below. No idea what they pulled as of recording this video, but I'm hoping they pulled some heat just as we are about to do. If you are here, you are one of these boys. Anytime you show up to one of my videos, You'll see that it is kind wow, do you see that splash? You'll see that it is. <laughs> Every single video of mine is dedicated for the boys, regardless of gender. If you are here, you are one of these boys, all about cracking packs and cracking brews. Behind me, you'll see a sneak peek for the prize of my soon-to-be-coming sealed-only challenge. That's right, we got a Blue Eyes Toon Dragon hand-painted skateboard that me and my friend Kyle are going to be competing against each other for. Stay tuned for when that first video drops. It's going to be a really awesome series with a nice twist on Sealed Only. So with that being said, boys, let's get it going. It's honestly been a while since I opened any cards at all. Besides that Machina deck, which was like a month ago. And I am super excited for this. You know, the allure kind of wore off when I was doing it every day, unfortunately. But, now that I haven't opened any in a while, this box of Blazing Vortex is sure to be quite exciting. It's nine cards per pack, this is the latest core set. As you may know, a lot of people have opened it already, but not like me. So I'm thank you guys again for stopping by. We got the first pack on deck, and let's see what we got. Okay, that Icy Breeze Refrain. Fabled Marcosia. Guitar Gunnards. Duang, <laughs> what the fuck? Shredders. Guitar Gurnards Duanig Duanigus. Something like that. Fairy Archer Ingunar. What is what is this archetype? Fairy Archer Ingunar. Ingunar. Ingunar? I don't know. Tribergrade Kit. Okay, so that's our first super. Armed Dragon Blitz. Cool that they got oh the War Rock best archetype. Cool that they're bringing Arm Dragon's back with some legacy support. I haven't seen too many people talking about playing them, so maybe it's not all that hot. But still, regardless, it is a fan favorite card from the anime. Chaz bringing out that Arm Dragon level 10. What an epic moment. Ojama Pink. We, now we got a baby one. We got Baby Yoda, so they got baby Ojamas. If you didn't catch Konami doing that, I think they're just cashing in on the baby hype. Kind of weird if you ask me, but hey, Ojama's been weird since day one. It's nothing new. Reinforcement of the army's troops. Okay. Another attack-based thing. Okay, so we got an Armed Dragon Thunder level 3. That one's exciting. I think I would actually like to play Armed Dragon if given the opportunity and enough of the cards. Now, boys, I know I keep talking about the sealed only and not posting it. It's been three weeks since I dropped that. Machina deck profile, which if you haven't checked it out yet, you should. Materiactor Gigadra. Cool. But it is coming and it'll be a really cool series where my friend and I are training to get to the local competitive level, because neither of us have competed in a local tournament before. We got into quarantine, or we got into Yu-Gi-Oh! at the start of quarantine, so actually neither of us have competed competitively and we thought of a cool sealed only idea where we will help each other get better at the game Parametal Foes Azortless. And eventually compete, and whoever does better is going to win that skateboard behind me. I think it'll be a really cool series. I just want to make it right, uh, up the production value compared to my other videos, and so that's kind of where all the time is coming in, why it's taking so long, and planning and all that stuff. But it will be coming your way soon, and I think you guys will really like that. Dual Avatar Ascendance, Heavy Metal Foes Amalgam, Arm Dragon Level 10 White as the first Ultra Rare. Cool. Spriggan's Peter. Unclus Bar. I think that looks like Machina Spider or something like that. Or the Machina Sniper. And then they made a dark version of it. Not sure if it's any good or not. Um, the dark Machina monster they introduce in the deck actually, I think, clashes because it's not an Earth Machine. And you really want it to be an Earth Machine to get the Machina Citadel effect. But hey, they're adding stuff. Materiactor Gigaboros. Seems like a cool card. 
Nether Spriggan's Peter, the Tilted Try, Dream Mirror Recap. They talking about that Dark Pit. Leave a like if Dark Pit is your main in Smash. I don't play him, but hey, a lot of people seem into it. One Ultra and a bunch of Supers so far, and we're more than halfway done with the left side of the box. Maybe we got shorted on this one? I don't know. Pendulum Encore. I see the Heavy Metal Foes cards in here. Maybe they are thinking about Warrock Fortia. Maybe they're thinking about bringing back Electromite. Who knows? We got that Fabled Treason. Amon Kujaki. That's a cool name. Stairway to a Fabled Realm. Not the Stairway to Heaven. Tri Brigade Rendezvous. Alright, so still only one Ultra Rare. But hey, maybe there's a Starlight in here. You never know. Parametal Foes Melcaster. That's, uh... <laughs> Kind of like the art for the new IP Masquerina people are hyped about. Waifu's riding a bike, people are into it. S-Force Showdown, Spriggan's Call, Fabled and Wraith. Now that's actually a really cool card artwork. I think Synchro cards look the best in general. Like, I don't know, the white border just really looks good on a trading card. At me if you don't agree. I don't know what to tell you. Ancient Warrior Sarga, Chivalrous Path, we got them boys squaring up in the woods. Knight of Armor Dragon. Okay, so there's a pendulum or there's a ritual one I didn't know about. Heavy Metal Foes Amalgam. We got that waifu. Virtual World Autohimi Tutu. I think that card is expensive now? I'm not really sure. I didn't actually look up any of the prices beforehand of these cards, which probably would have been helpful to gauge how I'm doing, but I'll tally up the values of my pulls as I'm editing this. Reinforcement of the Army's Troops, Spriggan's Rocky, Seal Star Regulator, Spriggan's Branga, okay, Heavenly Zephyr, Miradora. Secret Rare. Not sure if that's good or not, but hey, we pulled a first Secret Rare. Tribergrade Rendezvous, Archfiend Staff of Despair, shout out to the Axe of Despair from back in the day, and then a Sargus to end off that pack. Last pack of the left side, boys. Coming in at 10 minutes recording time. Maybe I'll try to speed that up a little bit. Dual Avatar Ascendance. Dream Mirror Disciple. Linear <laughs> linear Equation Cannon. That's a real card that exists now. War Rock Skylar. Spriggan's Ship Explorer. <laughs> Explorer. Okay. Dope. Xyz Ultra Rare. Spriggan's Captain Spargus, Ojama Pink, Digital Bug, Restrider, Registrider, and a Triber Grade Rendezvous. Okay, we got that Melcaster, Pendulum Encore, S Force Showdown, the Spriggan's Call, and a Rebellious Lu Fang. Nice. That boy is looking real rebellious on his red horse. Ah, the alliteration is there. Tilted Try, and a Dream Mirror Recap. I'm kind of being all over the place, right side of the box, by the way, with where I'm holding the cards on this one, so where, where I'm going to overlay my face, I'm not really sure yet, but, oh shit, that's not really the important part of the video anyway. It's my smooth talking and my smooth pulls. We got the Spriggan's Watch. That is a pretty cool card. I haven't seen artwork like that before. All right. Reinforcement of Army's Troops, Spriggan's Rocky, Steel Star Regulator, we got that Branga there with that big jet, Arm Dragon Thunderbolt, okay, not too many Arm Dragon cards pulled that I've seen, but doesn't mean we won't pull all of them in the next side of the box, or the next few packs, I should say. Parametal Foes Fusion, didn't realize Metal Foes had fusions, but hey, that's pretty cool. Maybe it was in this box and I'm just blind. White Baking, okay. Skull Servant deck coming along. This artwork is crisp, by the way. If you haven't seen this card in real life, it's super HD. Like, the nicest thing I've ever seen. There's like a hair in the bottom of my booster box. I'm not going to show you because it's gross, but somebody at Kunami... Kunami. Must have been sweating. There must be a Starlight Rare in here. War Rock Ultra Rare. Bashelios, okay. On our way to an epic Tier 0 War Rock deck. Okay, we got that virtual world gate. Stairway to a fabled realm. All right, fabled treason. 
I know you guys don't really care to see the whole box anyway, so forgive me for going fast. We got the Dream Mirror Disciple, War Rock Skylar, S Force Professor, Fabled Maricosia, Psychic Eraser Laser. Okay, cool. It's a removal that gives them life points, but it sends to the graveyard and doesn't destroy, so that's kind of nice. And it doesn't target either, so that's neat. I wonder if it's any good. Psychic Eraser Laser. Dogmatica Genesis. Giga Thunder Giga Clops. Reinforcement of the Army's Troops. Armor Dragon Ritual. S Force. Orifist. I'm not really familiar with the S Force if they're doing much. I haven't heard anybody talking about it, so I imagine they're uh, War Rock tier. I don't really know. Only a couple packs coming up, so there must be a secret rare. Or I got shorted. We'll see. Linear Equation Cannon. Arm Dragon Lightning. Spriggan's Rocky. Dual Avatar. Constellar. Caudiusius. Okay. Fable Treason. Archfiend Staff of Despair. Spriggan's Breast. And that Machina card. Okay, so we got four packs left. Only three Ultra Rares. And one Secret Rare pulled so far. So we'll see how we do. Hopefully they're uh, in here. Icy Breeze Refrain. EMR is a super rare. So if the math is correct, we got a secret rare and two ultra rares left in these last three packs. So fingers crossed we didn't get screwed by Komani. Okay, we got another heavy metal foes amalgam. Pendulum, Encore, neat with that odd eyes hanging out there. Ancient Warriors staring down. S Force Rappa Chimaru. Okay, we got an S Force and a Heavenly Zephyr as our secret rares. Don't think either of those are the valuable ones, but when a first set first comes out, secret rares tend to be worth more anyway. I'll put the prices up there and we'll see how we did. Last pack magic boys. I forgot to do the last pack love tap, but it's not too late. Tap the camera. Show myself a little love. Again, boys, thank you for stopping by. It's a lot of fun pack battling with people. I don't do it often. But, it is a nice time. I got some boys out there. There's our dual avatar empowered Mitsujaku. There's an ultra rare. So there is hope that we didn't get shorted. It's always fun when I do it. I think I will have another one coming out soon with Outer God openings in a week or two. Who's my other Yugi boy out there. Hey, if you also make content like this and you'd like to collab sometime, let me know. It's a lot of fun. I got two main homies that I talk to most of the time on Instagram and on in the comments. But hey, if you want to hang out with me and be one of my boys and make content collabs together, just let me know. I'm down. Alright, last pack. That's why I didn't tap it. I'm an idiot. Oh well. Spriggan's Call, Giga Thunder Cyclops, Steel Star Regulator, and Great Sea, Great Sand Sea Gold Gondola. That is a super rare card to end it off. So we only got four ultra rares in this box, which is kind of a bummer. Wind Witch Blizzard Bell, Spriggan's Captain Sargus, Ojama Pink, and a Digital Bug Restrider. Hashtag Baby Things 2021. I don't know. Again, boys, thank you for coming by. Part of the pack. I wish the best of luck to you. Hope you did better than me. I kind of pulled titties from this. But you know what? You're a great guy, and I wish you the best. Boys, leave a like, leave a subscribe, come back and check some more content, and stay tuned for that sealed only sparring series, which I'll be dropping in the very near future. Once again, my name is D. Got him.